hoping that she's gaining weight at a decent rate. This little creamy sleeper, the little bunny feet. Quick update. Like I said, baby girl is here. She was six pounds, one ounce. So I decided to vlog today because my baby has her first doctor's appointment. I am currently five days postpartum. She came a week early. See, that's why you don't supposed to pop zits or blackheads or because it leaves a mark. And I'm aggravated. But yeah, quick update. Like I said, baby girl is here. She was six pounds, one ounce. Much smaller than my son. My son was eight pounds, three ounces. And you know, when you in a hospital, your baby lose weight a lot, like the first couple of days, whatever like that. So by me um, breastfeeding, I was only nursing her in the hospital. So they told me that she was like losing weight. I wasn't able to like pump and actually see how much milk that she was taking because I was literally just nursing, put her down, nurse, you know what I'm saying? So now since I'm at home and I'm pumping and I can see like, okay, this is a one ounce bottle. She took this at this time. Okay, she drank another one ounce bottle. Okay, she took 50 milliliters, okay? You know what I'm saying? Like, so I can actually see how much milk she's, you know, intaking. So hoping that she's gaining weight at a decent rate. Um, they'll tell us at the doctor. What else? Like I said, she came out pretty small, so none of her clothes fit. It's crazy. Cause she got like zero to three months they all like swallow her so i have to go buy her like some newborn clothes and even like a couple people bought her like a couple like newborn sleepers those are big as well so i'm gonna just grab her a few newborn things from carter's and then maybe like one or two preemie sleepers just so she can have like a little bit of clothes i don't want to buy too many clothes because it's like girl you already have a whole wardrobe that you just can't fit into right now so i need to buy like a temporary wardrobe like a preemie slash newborn wardrobe just so we can you know get into the zero to three months three months six months you know so she sleep right now i'm about to pump probably for like 15 minutes real quick so i was only able to pump for like five minutes <laughs> before she woke up so I'm going to just let her nurse on me for a little while. And then I'm going to um, pump again before we leave. We got to leave in like an hour. So I'm going to fire some more real quick. Like I said, all her clothes is like kind of big. So, um, yeah. Oh, y'all. I finally got my nails off. So, bam. Y'all know I'm press on queen. But I decided to get um, a full set for my shower just in case, you know, we open a box. So I'm like, I'm just going to get a full set. I got a full set and I really did not like it. And I'm like, I paid $60 for something. And I really didn't like the outcome of it. When I could have paid like $7 for a pack of press ones. Like 28 nails. So that's about like two sets. So with that being said, the full set is off. The press ones, they're coming back maybe today. So yeah. So that's going to be my form of self-care today. Giving myself a new set. I'm sorry, I know it's cold out here. Thank you. We're going to go ahead and step down. I know. I'm sorry. Okay. You're going to lift her up. Oh. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. <laughs> y'all so it's the next day i figured that this is probably just gonna be a mom vlog because i didn't get that much footage at her doctor's appointment 
Um, doctor's appointment went good. She's gaining weight as she should. I was nervous about her belly ribbon levels because I know with my son, he had jaundice. And we had got like admitted to the hospital like a few days after he was born just so he could sit under the light for 24 hours. So I was just nervous that that probably would have happened to her as well. But they checked her levels. They were good. So we love that. We love to see it. Um, I told you I was concerned about her weight. So the doctor told me that by two weeks, they should be back to like their birth weight. When she checked her weight yesterday, she was six pounds and a half an ounce. So she's already like a half ounce, basically back at her birth weight with a week left to make that. So that is good as well. I figured that since this is a mom vlog, I might as well just talk to y'all and just show y'all like little things that I'm buying for her here and there. Um, I told y'all that she was a little small, so she couldn't fit none of her clothes. So I just went to Carter's and got her this little preemie sleeper, the little bunny feet. And then I got her this newborn sleeper, a flower pattern, and then this newborn sleeper with just different little animals, insects, and all of that. Honestly, I only like zipper sleepers. Cause it's easier to zip down and up i hate like having to unbutton and snap um, i do it especially if it's like a gift to us you know what i'm saying but whenever i buy sleepers i only buy zip sleepers also she um has a bottle warmer so i'm happy about this now because i was doing it the old-fashioned way warming up some water in the microwave and putting her bottles inside of there at the times that i'm not nursing her and i want to give her a bottle i was doing it that way so now she has a bottle warmer. I'm getting like our little night station together. It's in this area y'all can't see, but I want to have like a mini fridge, the bottle warmer. I low key want the hatch, like a sound machine. Right now I got like a sound machine playing on the TV and she actually slept well with it. So I low key want to get the hatch to see what the hype is about. And it's also a night light as well, but her little nighttime station is coming together. I ordered her a little mini fridge, so I just gotta pick it up, but I ain't driving for like another week, so yeah. Free me out the house. <laughs> right now, I am about to, I don't even know. Her nap about to be over and already pumped, so I ain't really got too much stuff to do besides clean. I don't want to indulge in it because once I start cleaning, I'll be wanting to do it all at once. And I know I'm not going to be able to finish since her nap is basically up. So I might just lay next to her and start editing like a YouTube video or something. So I can still feel like I'm being productive. Hey y'all, y'all know it's not a vlog of mine until I come on with a voiceover. Right here, I'm just cleaning her bottles and refilling them with the breast milk. But I'm actually going to end the video right here. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, shout my brand out. Peace.